Good morning from the Illinois State Capitol. It's the third week of April, and today joining me is a group from our district, the Student Advisory Council that Representative Mike Tryon and myself have been working with. And they've had a really interesting couple days learning a lot about what goes on here in, in the state capitol and how the legislative process works. So I just want to get an opportunity to ask you a couple questions. But before I ask you any questions, um, introduce yourselves. Okay, uh, I am Jordan Nimmer. I'm from Crystal Lake. I go to Crystal Lake Central High School. Um, I'm Madeline Lanham. I, I'm from West Dundee and I go to Jacobs High School. Great. Well, welcome to Springfield. You've learned a lot in the last couple of days, I think. Um, tell me a little a bit about uh, what was the most interesting thing that you learned about uh, Springfield and about the legislative process here? I think it was such an amazing opportunity to sit in on the session in in house. We got to sat in the Galleria, and it was amazing. Uh, we also got to tour the governor's mansion, and we actually got to play with the governor's dogs, which was an amazing opportunity. I heard that you got to play with the dog. Interesting day, right? Interesting. Yeah, it was. The names are Stella and Pumpkin. They're really cute, actually. <laughs> um, I think the most interesting thing for me was probably seeing the difference between the Senate session and the House session. Uh, just the number of people and how the sessions are conducted, it was really interesting to see. I'll bet. You know, people come down here with certain expectations, and then and then they find out something that really kind of surprises them. What was the what was the surprise moment for you? Something that you thought you you assumed one thing, and then it ended up to be surprisingly different. Well, when you see politicians on TV, they seem so stark and so stone cold. But when you actually get to meet with politicians in real life, they're so much more personable than you would have ever expected. And it's such an amazing thing to see how relatable and how real politicians actually are. Well, that's very nice. What do you nice. think? What was your most surprising moment? Um, well, coming into Springfield, I always thought that the legislature was very closed off, uh, kind of a boys club, which it still kind of is, but you know, women are breaking through in that sort of sense. But what really surprised me was the amount of opportunities young people have to get involved with the politics and with their their own legislature and stuff like that. Like for instance, the internships that they have available through Illinois University or like as a page on the floor, that's really interesting to me. And it's encouraging to see young people getting involved in politics. You both sound like future young leaders. Uh, we hope to see you working here in the Capitol. Is there a particular issue for, for each of you that you're really passionate about that you want to make sure that we deal with and that you want to continue to work on? Well, obviously, I'm very concerned about the budgets uh, right now. And I think personally, uh, school education policy really has a long way to go. And uh, it's interesting to see how far it's going to go and how far it's come from now. And uh, yeah, I, I think it would be interesting to see how education policy transforms with our new governor. Me too. Um, I definitely agree with her. One of my, the major issues that I care about is education funding, education policy. And while I understand that the budget is a major issue, Illinois is in huge deficit, um, I do think that we still need to be actively funding and working on our education programs, especially in regards to working with the students in order to help the students rather than working with administration to help administration. Um, we really need to focus on what students need, especially in public schools in areas with a high poverty rate and things like that. Very thoughtful of both of you. I'm looking forward to watching your futures. I, I think we're looking at future young leaders in the state of Illinois. Thank you for joining us, and thank you, ladies, for joining us in the Illinois State Capitol. Thank you. Thank you.